The Food and Drug Administration has authorized a pill to treat COVID-19. Now it's the first FDA approved pill to treat the coronavirus. I'm really hoping this is a game changer based on the data from Pfizer and the ability to treat people at home. Uh, really, I think it's a great day for optimism. Well, it sounds pretty good, that's for sure. So what does it mean to uh, hopefully move us in the right direction out of this pandemic? Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Savino has been asking the experts. He joins us now with more. Mike, what are you finding out? Well, Mark, doctors are really excited about what this means for keeping people out of the hospital if they get COVID. Of course, it's important to remember that this does not actually prevent or reduce the risk of getting it. But as you said, this is the first pill approved to treat COVID. Uh, the other treatments that we've seen that are approved are given by IV. So for those treatments, you have to go to the hospital or go to a clinic. This Pfizer pill can be taken at home with the prescription. And Pfizer says that this pill is nearly 90 percent effective at keeping people out of the hospital. Well, that is certainly good news for a lot of people right now, especially with this new variant spreading so rapidly. When will this become available? Uh, and I'm assuming people have to get a, a prescription from a doctor. Yeah, absolutely, Mark. Uh, public health officials are still working out the details on when this rollout will happen, especially since supply will be limited in the beginning. Now, this FDA approval for now is just for people who are at higher risk of hospitalization, people with pre-existing conditions, for example. Doctors will need to prioritize who gets a prescription, especially with that limited supply at first. Now, this pill is most effective in the first few days after infection, which means it's important to get tested if you have symptoms or if you think you've been exposed to the virus. And of course, we know people have had a hard time getting tested, so that will also need to be addressed.